If you would like to juggle like this, and if you want to learn juggling, you need to first have the right kind of balls to try and juggle with. And today in this video, I am going to tell you how to choose the right kind of juggling balls to learn juggling. I am Tejasvi Anand and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I am going to teach you how to choose a right juggling ball for learning juggling. Well there are various kinds of juggling balls and uh, you have to follow a small checklist to know what kind of juggling ball is right for you to learn juggling. So the first point is the ball should be heavy so that when you throw and catch the ball it will go exactly the same way as you want it to go and it will not take any diversion due to wind or it will not get distorted when you are practicing outdoor so that is point number one point number two is when you drop a ball it should not roll away like so because when you're practicing, it will be very tiring for you to go pick it up and come back and then start juggling again. So it ha when you put throw the ball and when it falls down, it has to stay where it falls. So that is point number two. And uh, if any ball that you have fulfills that criteria, then you can start juggling with it. And I would recommend a soft, squishy ball because it will be easier to grip. So today, if you don't have such a ball and you want to buy such a ball, you can just buy bean bags or stage balls or Russian balls. Whereas, if you want to make one for yourself, this is the right YouTube video. To make your own juggling balls at home, you need a few things and they are right here a thread a sock actually three of them a measuring cup and a bowl of rice or millet or any sundry grains how do you go about it first measure a specific quantity of rice Now, I have put one and a quarter cup of rice into one bowl and similarly, you put according to your cup size and also your the size of the ball that you want to make. And now, tie a knot just like so. Once you have tied a knot, invert the socks like this, pushing the whole rice ball inside. Now take the thread and tie it tight. the sock again once again now we have a juggling ball that you can practice juggling with and this ball actually 
fulfills all the checklist that I had told you. If the ball drops, it doesn't run away. And uh, it is heavy and it does not come in the influence of wind. So this is the simplest juggling ball that you can make. So now we have made our first very own juggling ball so that you can start juggling. Well, in my next videos, I am going to teach how to juggle. So make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon so that you will receive notification whenever I upload the new video and make sure you share it with the like-minded people who wants to learn juggling and if you are wondering what are the benefits of juggling and why I should learn juggling, then check out this video. Thank you.